Okay, so start from Emily's uh, Emily's speech. I think she, uh, her speech really resonates with everyone who has a experience of a loved one pass away. And I love her tones and beautiful languages and voices she used when she told the story. Um, I think her story was quite inspiring. Um, whoosh, whoosh. Yeah, thank you whoosh. for doing this while voting. <laughs> And yeah, because I always hope that I can talk about the story of my past grandpa, but I never come up with courage, and I cannot come up with a structure to talk, uh, tell the story without any emotion. But after her speech, I think I might try doing that. Okay, and the next speaker is Kelly, and also um, so instead of Emily, uh, she talked about like very details stories of a short period of time. Kelly talked about um, like a story with a like a bigger picture, a bigger time scope, and also about a lot of family members and also life story of grandma. Um, I remember the uh, uh, she a sentence she said. She said, we always think we have more time. That is quite a touch and inspiring for me because I always think that too. So hopefully after listening to Kelly's speech, everyone can enjoy the moment, seize the moment, and take action now if you have anything you want to do with someone. Right, okay, and the next one is a Chinese speech um, given by Iris, Zhou Ruizhen. 我看到他的题目的时候 就先怎么对待别人放下自己的成见，你先愿意对别人，呃，散播一些温暖和开心，就可以期待你旁边的世界也慢慢变得更温暖一些。Hey, okay, and the next speech given by Louis Lin. Oh, every time I heard Louis speech, I um his speech makes me feel I want to do more workouts. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> and the sentence that strikes me is. We were, we are, maybe we can be the first workout Toastmasters club. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> and in his speech today really engaged everyone. And, um, and I also like the sentences like, a fitness is a game, blah, blah, blah. Um, and I also like the squats that we did together. Maybe next time you can all do like push ups or something else. <laughs> right? Great speech. Okay, and for table topics, oh, I like to say, um, I really like Lila's like um, um, hosting. She connected every everyone, and he, she connects the questions with the topic thing. So like, make every question so customized to everyone, and then we can hear a lot of personal stories, right? And I think, um, yeah, for so I'm going to oh, going through every speaker in the table topic session. So Mark, I I enjoy um watching uh, looking at Mark giving speech because he always looks so nervous but so calm <laughs> at the same time. That was quite interesting. I like <laughs> yeah Mark did a great job. And Victoria, I think she has a she could be a brand ambassador for red wine. <laughs> and for Jenny, Jenny Zhang really born to. Give table topic speech. <laughs> yeah. I, I think your speech, you always make me feel like you prepared the table topic topics for your whole life. <laughs> so confident and calm. And for um, all the other, sorry, I'm running out of time. So, <laughs> but I love your table topic speech. Speech. And for the evaluation, I would like to share uh, the takeaways I got from that part. 
So first one, internal your idea, be comfortable on stage. Like I think I should learn this. And second, vocal variety, I will try to give up in mind. And also eye contact. I feel I didn't, I missed a lot of eye contact today, so I'm trying to get more now. <laughs> <laughs> and then at the end, sorry, overall, I think, yeah, thank you both to, uh, for giving a great topic today to have everyone reflecting on our inspiring speeches we did Which together book? and heard before. I think this is really a good throwback before the new term start. It's really engaging, interactive, and energetic. Thank you, everyone. <laughs>